Hello, welcome to this comprehensive course on Romeo and Juliet. I'm Susan Allen, your course presenter. This course will provide you with um, a complete understanding of the meaning of the play, as well as the underlying themes, the characters and the uh, symbolism. I advise you to follow this uh, course in sequence. Start with the summaries. Uh, the, the summaries will give you a, a basic idea of what the play is about. It will give you understanding of the main story behind it all. Just a piece of advice. If you are um, watching the summaries, just pause them because they run the clips run a bit fast. I did put some music in the background to slow it down, but um, it doesn't really, it's still very fast. So you won't be able to read the entire summary for each um, act and scene if you, if you don't uh, pause it. So do that. Then please follow the course in sequence. The, go to the reading of the script, listen to the audio and follow the script on screen, which I've provided. And only then go to the translation. The reason for this is that uh, when you get an exam paper, if you've got to be tested on this, you're going to get the original script and you're going to have to be able to recognize it in its original form. Then uh, the historical and background section will give you a better idea of the settings during the Shakespearean times. It will give you a sense of the atmosphere in the um, theatre, the globe, and the interaction between the actors and the audience. That is also very useful to get a better understanding of the play. Then exam questions, which are also provided, will give you assistance with uh, preparing for an exam or a test on the play. So doing those will actually give you very, very good practice. Then remember that this is a play. It's meant to be read and it's meant to actually to be performed. If you can get hold of a video of the play, it will also be useful to add on to your knowledge I would recommend the older version with uh, Olivia Hussey and Leonard Whiting, not the more modern version with uh, Claire Danes and, um, what's his name? <laughs> I've not forgotten, from Titanic. Um, so rather go and watch the old version because that's a classical version and that will also give you an idea of emotions and everything. Also throughout, remember that Romeo and Juliet were extremely young. In those days, people got older young at a younger age because girls got married earlier. Juliet's only 13. Romeo, I think, is about 16, 17. And um, so the emotions are like melodramatic and over-enhanced. There's also a very strong theme of death throughout the the play from the very beginning. In any case, I uh, hope you see you on, to see you on the other side. Dive in and enjoy. <laughs> 